Here's the end of the first day for irrigation. I got all this uh, underlayment. Um, I don't know if it's really underlayment, but it's like, it's geofabric that's gonna go here to protect this whole slope. That slope needs to be very protected. And then I've got several hundred dollars worth of uh, ground cover and flats here like different types of ice plant here and a whole bunch of gazania and I'm gonna put those like around this edge and then I'm gonna put some seeds over top of the fabric this is just too big of an area to purchase and plant it's gonna have to go from seed but I got to get stuff in pretty quick so it kind of roots in and holds it and so I've done uh, started running the irrigation I got the um, I tapped off this main line this is the water main and that main line is a little deeper underground and it goes up to here and so basically the main line is right here so I sent um, a one inch pipe out this way put three irrigation controllers here and then sent the one inch main up this way and I put this um, hose spigot and so from there this one right here comes up to a riser there's going to be a drip line the drip line looks like this black roll right here so i got 500 feet of that so that drip line is going to go you know and snake along snake all along this edge and that's where the ground cover will be planted and then it's a t because i'm going to take the t and run it you know 100 feet that direction it wouldn't make sense to run it with the poly tubing i'm going to run it with hard white pipe um, dig a trench buried underground and then do more drip tubing you know over here and then I can put, put little holes in there and put little emitters so that's the one pipe um, the next two come out like this then go this way turn here one of those is going to go to this hillside and put big long distance sprayers probably three or maybe four you know shooting way down there and that's what's going to water the seeds and then the other pipe is going to go along this edge and that's going to connect up to be a few more trees right here so like this whole row you know there's one two right there three four five six let's probably do seven eight and nine um so those will be kind of fruit trees and that's going to be fed from here and then in the future you know that'll be a fairly small station I just when the electricals run to the building and everything I run little wires over there and I can control them in the future I'll run some much larger pipe down off this way and I'll put somewhere down in here a bigger set of valves to make room for a lot of avocados or you know I'll probably pull from there to do the grape vines and all that stuff too and so um that's pretty much end of the day i'm gonna clean some stuff up bury this bury this pipe i just got it all glued and set and probably hook the hose up and um do some cleanup before it gets dark which will be pretty soon <laughs>